We're going to Kentucky. Hey everybody, welcome back to Living Traditions Homestead. This is Kevin and Sarah. Well, today we've got the trailer hooked up to the SUV and we're taking a road trip to Kentucky. Why are we doing that? Well, this is super exciting. Uh, we were contacted by one of our subscribers. Her name is Raylene and she just doesn't want to raise rabbits anymore. And she has um, a herd of silver fox meat rabbits. Uh, she contacted us and uh, let us know that we are welcome to um, have them. And uh, so we're off to Kentucky, a day trip, a road trip with the family uh, to pick them up. It's about a four and a half hour drive from where we live and she's driving four hours so we're meeting right in the middle and uh, we're going to meet her and we're going to get these rabbits. Uh, we're super excited if you're not familiar with the uh, silver fox rabbits. Uh, they're a heritage meat breed of rabbits. They're actually recognized by the American Livestock Conservancy as a, uh, a, a rare uh, rabbit. Uh, so we're excited to uh, get some of these into our herd and be able to raise them and hopefully maybe bring back uh, a breed that isn't raised much anymore. Absolutely. Raylene has two uh, does, breeding does and a breeding duck. Yes, a breeding <laughs> duck. <laughs> yeah. So Raylene has a breeding trio of the silver fox rabbits. There's two does and a buck. Um, and there are two litters already that are about 10 weeks old. We're going to be getting those two. And we just found out that both of her does just had another litter each of baby rabbits so we're going to be bringing home babies in nesting boxes even right so in total i think there's there's like 32 rabbits there's yeah there's a lot of <laughs> rabbits uh so we're we're gonna go get them um we're hoping they make the trip okay uh, we think they will um and we're not expecting any rain or anything because all we have is our open trailer uh we will cover them with a tarp to help uh you know uh, keep some of the sun off of them but we think they'll do just fine and uh so we're excited uh, but we need to hit the road because we need to drive there. Again, it's about four and a half hours. Uh, meet Raylene, get the rabbits, and then drive all the way back uh, before, uh, you know, nighttime when we need to do our nighttime chores. Right. So uh, it's going to be a long day, lots of driving, but we're super excited. And we're going to hit the road, and you're going to come along with us. Let's get going. They're all labeled, herbs and a, a paprika pepper I'm growing and 
uh, some flowers. Yeah, that's what I'm about. You mean nuts, peppers? Well, we just made it home. Uh, took about 10 hours round trip uh, to go get these rabbits. Uh, but it looks like they all made the trip uh, really well. Yes. Uh, we had them covered with some tarps, as you saw in the trailer. And uh, they did a really good job on the way home, even though it was pretty warm out today. So we're going to start unloading them, and we'll show you guys uh, just how well they're doing. There. Get them on some grass. <laughs> Let them start eating some grass. They'll be happy. All six of these babies made it. Mama and babies made it. This mom actually just gave birth yesterday. Yeah, so, last night. So that one we were a little, we weren't sure about, but all the babies are alive. They look good and mom's in there with them. So yeah. perfect. Looks like there are about seven of them in there. This is the other mama. Uh, she had babies a week ago. She has five of them. Uh, they're all in great shape. They're super fat and happy. They're so cute. And uh, this is the second um, litter of older babies. They're, uh, I think they're about 10 weeks old actually. Uh, there are eight of them and they look fantastic. Uh, these silver fox rabbits are beautiful. Uh, we have uh, some that are black, some that are gray, and uh, some that are kind of brown, uh, maybe cinnamon colored. Uh, they are absolutely beautiful. We're yeah. so excited to have them. Yeah, we're definitely uh, going to keep at least a breeding pair and, and, and the buck, um, you know, as full-time residents because we're excited to learn more about this breed and, and play around with, you know, what we can do uh, getting some some really good genetics out of them. So we're, we're super excited. Yeah, we've learned that the Silver Rocks, Silver Fox rabbits are not only a meat breed, uh, but they're also a fantastic fur breed. Um, and uh, that's one thing that Kevin has wanted to learn a little bit more about is uh, tanning hides and that kind of thing. So uh, it's very possible that uh, he'll be learning those skills with these silver fox rabbits as well. Yeah. So you guys, uh, you know, you can see one of the big changes that we we're talking about coming, and that is that we're expanding our rabbitry to now include uh, these uh, um, silver fox, these silver fox heritage breed rabbits. Uh, we're super excited to have them here, and we're so grateful to uh, Raylene for yes. thinking about us. Uh, when she was uh, ready to get rid of these rabbits. So uh, you guys, if you're not a subscriber yet, uh, go ahead and hit that subscribe button below. Uh, if you're one of our traditionalists who comes back every day, thank you so much. Uh, we're glad that you're joining us on our journey as we now expand. Uh, lots of great things about to happen on the homestead. And so, if you enjoy our channel and you enjoy these videos, please share with your friends and family because that always helps us spread the word about our channel. We appreciate it.
And until next time, you guys, thanks for stopping by the homestead. Take care, and God bless. God bless.